Hey guys, this is Caldyfell1 here, and today I'm going to be doing a Thompson Railway layout video. Now, I lasted one of these around a year ago, and, you know, since I've gotten a lot of new destinations since then, I just thought, you know, hey, we might be fun to do another one of these. Uh, so yeah, so without further ado, let's just get started. So let's start here at Timmet Station, where Thomas is with Annie and Clarabelle. Uh, Timmet Station is actually one of the newer items in my collection. I got it around, I think, a couple weeks ago, and even though it's obviously not at all accurate to how it appears in the show, you know, I still quite like it. And so Thomas is currently by a set of points. If you go forward, you just reach uh, a pair of special engine sheds where Donald and Douglas are. And then if you go on the other line, uh, you just go around to where to a T-switch where Gordon is pulling to and after express coaches. And Gordon's line just goes over this crossing and past this conductor shed to another T-switch. Uh, we'll go that way in a little bit, but if we go this other way, uh, we'll go around to where Toby and Henrietta are by this like random station building from the James Goes Buzz Buzz set. I think this is technically supposed to be Tinmet, but obviously it looks nothing like that, so I'm just going to call it some random generic station. And then there's also Terrence off to the side. So Toby is currently about a set of points over here. We'll go this other way in a second, but if we go forward, uh, you'll go past the barrel loader, and then we'll reach another switch over here near where Elizabeth is. And then this line just goes around back to this T-switch by Gordon. And so if we go to this other line by Toby, uh, if you go right, I'll go around through this crossing, and then... We'll reach like this little area of the layout where there's basically just a bunch of switches and lines branching off. So here, obviously, we have Daisy in the special engine shed with Caroline off to the side. Uh, here we have Stephanie in the Abbey repair shop with Birdie over by Timmet Station. Uh, Henry's over by this coal loader, and then this line just leads to the soda or engine wash, which just ends in buffers. Uh, and there's no engines right there currently. Um, then if you go beyond Henry, then we'll go over the so uh, we'll go over the swing bridge, which is another relatively new item, and then we'll reach a set of points where Oliver and Toad are. And then if you go on this line, we'll go past the signal box and reach another junction where Edward and Trevor are. Uh, Edward is currently at the ice cream factory with a couple of milk tankers. If we follow his line, then we'll just go around underneath the swing bridge and then we'll reach like this little area, which I guess you kind of consider to be the harbor. So um, if you go, so this first switch here, if you follow this line, then you'll go around past the stop and go station to Duck's line at the harbor where he just has a bunch of troublesome trucks, and beyond the cargo crane is just the work shed. And then going back over here, oh, going back over here, uh, we'll go past another set of points, and then to Percy's line, he's just running a bunch of cargo cars. And then real quick, going back here, if you go on this line, then you'll just go through the single stone tunnel back to Thomas to Tidmouth. And so going back to where Duck is, his line connects with another set of points, uh, and goes past Mike, who is currently in the real useful engine shed. And so his line just goes around, past George underneath this bridge, and then just loops around to where Duke is with Ada, Jane, and Mabel, and there's Mr. Percival. And then one of the lines that branches from the switch by where Duke is, that just goes back to where Edward and Trevor are. And if we keep following Duke's line, we'll just go forward to a V-switch, and then if we keep going beyond that, then we'll reach the fire station. So uh, here we have Belko in the shed off to the side. We got two fire trucks, Shotman and Lady Hat. Uh, we got James out of the water tower with the fire engine, and then there's Harold on the roof. And now on the other side of the fire station, we have another one of the fire trucks, and then this obviously just goes, goes back to the T-switch by where Toby and Gordon are. And then I believe there's just one more line left to cover. So going back to, going back to this V-switch by where Duke is, if you go this way, we'll go over this archstone bridge, around, and then up to this like set of points on the bridge where Caldy and Catherine are. If you go this way, then it'll just go around, then down, back to where Oliver and Toad are. And then if you keep going, keep going beyond Caldy, then it'll go around through the first of two Nafford covered bridges, and then to the Silver Bay bridges where Murdoch is pulling a goods train. And so if you just keep going beyond that, then it'll just go through another Nafford covered bridge, and then down and around, back to the set of points by where Elizabeth is. Uh, and so that's basically, that's basically the entire layout. Uh, I had a ton of fun building this, and I'm overall super happy with how it turned out. So yeah, so that's basically all for now. Thank you all so much for watching, and until next time, this is Coldyfell1, signing out.